Okay, in this video, I'm gonna show you how you can use OBS to increase the canvas size from 1080p to 4K. This can allow you to record up to four sources, 1080p sources at once, and then split them up in a post-editing processing program. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started. So we have a new empty profile and an empty scene. I'm gonna go ahead and add a source. So let me go ahead and add a video capture device. Call this webcam one. And there we go. And I'm gonna change that resolution to from default to custom and make it 1080p. There's my first webcam. I'm gonna go in and make another scene. Actually, I don't need to make another scene. I'm actually gonna add another source for another webcam and video capture device, webcam two. And so I have two different Logitech webcams. Go to custom, 1080p. All right, perfect. Let me add a web browser display. Let's add a browser. Like that. And that's completely fine. Let's just add that. 20. 1080. Make sure I did that correct. Right, that went away, but that's fine. I'll just change that to google.com. There we go. So it's the home page for Google. Um, now we also have that 1080p and one more item that I'll add. Let's add a media source. Add a video that I have. There you go. I got a little something from Marvel Ultimate Alliance. that go full screen and I'm gonna close off the audio I don't need the audio um, for that okay so we have all four of these and they're all in a singular scene now I'm gonna set up a separate scene that's gonna take all these and put these in a different quadrant and the actually take that back I don't need to set up a different screen I can do this on the existing uh, scene scene here so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to settings I'm gonna go to video I'm gonna change the canvas resolution this is a 4K resolution. So it takes that 1920 and it multiplies it by two. So think about that if we're going from the width, so that's 1920 by times two. So the width is twice, so that means two videos can be side by side. Then we also need to do the height so we can get the four videos. So two across and two at the bottom. All right. And then we do the same thing for the output resolution. Now, if, you, if you're not doing this in a post-editing program, such as if you don't need to cut these four videos up separately, you can stick to you know 1080p, that'll downscale it essentially. So even though it's, uh, the canvas resolution is 4K, it'll still output t 1080p, so visible on basically one, res one high def uh, monitor. But I wanna be able to potentially cut these videos up separately. So I'm going to also set the output resolution to 4K that uh, 3840 by 2160. Click OK. So you now you see the screen real estate has changed. But because I'm in one source, I can start dragging these items. And OBS has a default snap utility. And so I can snap these. And because the resolution is just double of uh, uh, 1080p, this is what makes it easy to kind of snap and nothing's really being cut off. So matter of fact, and there's my two cameras right there. So matter of fact, what, I, what I'd probably do, I'd probably move the camera down here. I'd move Ultimate Alliance over here. And I'd move this Google situation over there. And so there we go. So we have both our cameras uh, set up in OBS. And I can use a post-editing program to cut these videos separately. So, all right. That's how you do a, that's how you increase the camera size of OBS. I'll do a future video where I show you how to cut these videos apart. 